From your Canva homepage, you're going to search for memes. It would be memes templates. You see, Canva has 174 templates that you could use as a meme or you could create one of your own. So if you scroll down, you could find anyone that speaks to you and then you can create it and use it on your social media pages. I found this one and I liked it. Now the content on this one says, when someone tells you that you're doing work for free, it will be a great exposure. The owl is saying, really? So I want us to tweak this one and make it our own and change it to our brand and then publish it. So what you do, you click on the canvas itself, you change color. My colors are these, so I would click on the color and you just adjust and you tweak the way that you want. So I like the wording that's on there. You just leave it or you could double click and then you type over it to whatever you want the wording to be. So I'm going to leave this one, but I just want to make the alignment to be in the center and I'm happy with that. You just tweak the picture and you center it nicely. I want to change this owl and I'm going to go to our elements and I'm going to search for either a no or a hell no or a really and then see what kind of pictures or photos I get. If I say really see like this. I could have her screaming, you just took and you drop it on there. Like, hell no. <laughs> or that one, or if you go with a no, this one, and like that. As easy as that. You go file, you go download, and you download it as a 1080 by 1080, and that's pretty much it. There's lots more of this kind of content on my course material. Head over to learnwithzart.com to learn more about Canva, whether you're pro or a beginner. I'll see you there.